What's up guys? Welcome back to another TDS video. Um, yes, I, I know I'm a bit late on the event tower update and the uh, Hexcape event battle pass and all that. But the thing is, I wanted to do this video so bad, but sickness has got to me. And um, I just wanted to focus more on schoolwork and academic studies for now. Um, that is the reason why I, I haven't been uploading lately. Also, um, it's Thanksgiving break for me. It just started, so um, I have no school, and I will be able to upload a lot more often for you guys. So, yeah, I know I'm a bit late for the uh, Hollow Punk and Harvester Event Tower Showcase. Yes, it was like a, a month ago, but I'm just going to showcase it anyway. Also, we have um, the Jason Slasher skin, which I haven't shown you yet. Also, we will showcase the uh, Wasteland Harvester in just a bit. But for now, we are just going to showcase Hollow Punk and Harvester. And then we'll get to the skins. So without further ado, let's get started. Now, yes, I know I have missed the Please Donate event. And, um... TDX is one year anniversary and something like that. Even the uh, TDX Halloween Battle Pass Showcase. I will be getting to that um, soon enough. Um, I just need more time to edit videos. I must say, I'm unimpressed! And um, upload it. So, yeah, um, just let me cook. Alright, um, I'm gonna farm a bit and I'll catch you later when I have the... Uh, Hollow Punk. Alright, since we might be dying anytime soon, I'm gonna just place down the Hollow Punk. So this is the only tower with only three levels. So yeah, this is the only tower with three levels. Level 1, it has um, damage increase. It has 20 range, and its fire rate is 3.7. So. Um, I'll just upgrade it. Its damage increased to 25. Its fire rate, I think, increased? I don't know. And its range. Oh yeah, you, you can see it knocking back um, enemies as well, a bit. Alright, this is the last level. It has flying detection, 26 range, 60 damage, and its rocket speed is increases from 20 to 25. Alright, now it's like a reddish design. And it does more, it even does burn damage, wow. Oh, it does not detect stealth. Wow. Um, are we gonna lose this? Oh crap! Wait, 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 wait. Oh, slasher. Okay, we're safe. All right, I might as well showcase the Jason Slasher. Now. So this is level one. This level 2, it received a knife in its mask. Alright, um, this is level 3. Okay, it received a different, um, cloak. And, um, its weapon changed from a knife to a... Looks to be like a machete. No, not, not, a, not a machete, but, um, looks like a different kind of knife. Yo guys, um, quick question here. Are we gonna survive? Oh yeah, we are. We, we survived this. Oh, it even has a little hatchet at the back. It's pretty cool design. About the Hollow Punk, Hollow Punk is basically just a cheaper version of Rocketeer. Um, would I replace Hollow Punk with Rocketeer? Mm, no, I don't think so. Um, I might just stick with Rocketeer, 
The only good thing is that it just um pushes enemies back a bit. And it does burn damage as well. Oh yeah, wait, did I show you? Oh yeah, this is max level Jason Slasher. So it has a lot of chains wrapped around its body. It has a uh, skull. And um, overall, it has a pretty intimidating design. And of course, this is a reference from the classic um, Jason Voorhees. All right, now we're gonna showcase the, the Harvester. Now this tower is pretty unique because um, it could actually summon harvests that you could place anywhere on the map. Um, level one, it has, I guess, more thorns. It looks like this. Level two, received like a belt around its waist. Level three, level four, it has, I guess, more thorns around, and it received a light. And this is the max level, and it's completely purple, so. Also, it has this secret ability where if you place it around farms, it will generate more thorns. See, <laughs> you see that? Bro, that's so epic. It literally generated a lot more thorns when it's placed around farms, so that is actually pretty cool. Alright, let's try this ability again. See? It even spawned thorns, like, over here. That is actually neat. I feel like this this tower is made to, like, kill off, um, spawns rather than bosses, because I doubt that this tower will work against bosses. And yes, as I promised, I will showcase the, uh, Wasteland Harvester. So far, um, Harvester's doing 36,000 DPS, so it's pretty cool. Alright, let's see if, um, Hollow Punks and Harvesters can face against the multi-boss. Purely Hollow Punks and Harvesters. Mm, so far, I mean, it's killing off its spawns first. Wrong placement. Oh shoot. Oh, what? They're right. Mm. I don't think we're doing that good, to be honest. Yeah. Um. So in conclusion, um, I don't think you're winning with just Harvester and Hollowpunk only. You might need. Um, a sub DPS to help you. Yeah. Jeez. And yes, um, this is the Wasteland Harvester. Um, this is what base level looks like. Level 1, received a piece of hair. Level 2, 3, 4, received a mask. And level 5. Dang, that actually looks kind of sick, not gonna lie. Um, yeah, it, it turned red. And it has um, lots of lights at the back. And um, this is what his thorns look like. They turn to um, lava. They're like a lava orange um, thorns. So it's pretty cool. And like I said, when you put it around farms, um, it will have more of those thorns. So, yeah, that secret ability is pretty cool and kind of useful for, like, early to mid-game. I wouldn't say it's good for late game or, like, at the final boss or something. But, yeah, pretty sick tower. And yes, guys, um, that is it for today's video. Um, I just wanted to um, do a little showcase on the vent towers and skins and all that. Yes, the commando rework is out, but apparently I'm br I'm broke, so I will make a video on that once I have um, enough Robux. 
Um, and the next video I'm planning on making is the, uh, um, the please donate hard mode, um, event thingy. Um, also, yes, the please donate farm or whatever it is, I will do a showcase on that. Um, I'm not sure if I want to skip the rewards or, um, just do the contract without pay to win. But, yeah. Um, thanks for watching. Um, have yourselves a great day and peace.